It is approaching 6.15 on your Friday. Now to the morning business report. Mortgage rates fall as the Federal Reserve prepares for further hikes. And today's jobs report is expected to show a hiring slowdown. Channel 3's Jane King is live now at the NASDAQ with these stories for us on our Friday. Good morning and happy Friday, Jane. That's right. Happy Friday. And it is a jobs report Friday. And we do think that U.S. employers have, are forecast to have added the fewest jobs in over a year in June. But economists say the slowdown isn't concerning, at least not yet. Now, forecasters expect the U.S. to have added 270,000 jobs last month, and this could provide an important clue as to whether the Federal Reserve will charge ahead and do another big interest rate hike or if they'll slow down. They do meet later this month. Now, average long-term U.S. mortgage rates eased again this week. Now, the Federal Reserve is raising interest rates, but those are typically the short-term rates, like credit cards and car loans. Those longer-term rates, like mortgages, have actually been falling on worries about a recession. And Walmart is making its in-home delivery service available to Walmart Plus subscribers for an extra $7 per month or $40 a year. Now, this service will bring groceries and other goods from your local Walmart into your home. They'll even put food in the fridge for you. The monthly cost, though, does not account the things you need to buy to be able to get that, like a compatible $50 smart lock and an automatic garage door opener for them to use as well. Well, the S&P 500 and NASDAQ are on the longest winning streak since March, four days now. Energy stocks leading the way higher yesterday. We do get that jobs report out 8.30 this morning. So ahead of that, we're pretty quiet, actually flat for the start today. Live from the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King. Back to you. And we don't want to jinx it. Thanks, Jane. Now